I love how Diggle evolved over the season because at first I wasn't sure if he was just going to be kind of the bodyguard kind of guy, but then he got really involved he did. and really into the action. How was that for you, That the fact that they took you there? Well, you know, so when I first got hired for the role, they said, we're going to really flesh out Diggle. And the first few episodes, they made good on that promise. They did for the whole season, really. And then kind of Diggle kind of, kind of not really fell by the wayside, but really more so kind of win the background a little bit. Yeah. There are other people to flesh out. And then they kind of returned back to him. The writers, I can't ask, <clears throat> I can't ask really to be serviced any better than the writers of Service Diggle. And the second season, after talking to Andrew and Mark, who are the creators, um, and Greg, they have so much plan for Diggle. It's just, it's incredible. Well, because he still has to get his vengeance. I know that was kind of, they kind of put a pin in that for the end of season one. They do. Do you he hope does. he gets that sooner, or do you think they should play it out a little longer? They really have something very, very big planned for Deadshot and Diggle. Mm, okay. Which they told me a little bit about. It's a whole storyline about how Diggle really connects Dig to his past that no one really expected. Okay. So, um, yes, there, he will get his vengeance, but not in the way you necessarily expect. Okay. Yeah. Now everybody talks about Stephen Amell being in such great shape. You're not too bad yourself. I, I try to keep up with, with Stephen. Right. Yeah, I mean, just no gluten. Is that what, is that, I was gonna say, what's the key? Is it working out a that's lot a, or is that's it a no big, gluten? Well, both of those. And, okay. but you work out and you can't eat potatoes. It's crazy, <laughs> man. It's wrong. It's, it's crazy sad. talk. That's great. It is sad. It is sad. I but know. you know, you got to keep the six. Stephen has like a 25 pack. Yes. I'm like, boy, how you do that? But I'm just trying to. I'm, I'm following in his footsteps.